So when he shoots, I go here. I got his hand trapped in my hand. I replace my hand with my body here. Once you get off the power, like when he reaches out to grab my legs, now he has power. He got to grab my legs. He's got my legs. But when I'm sprawling, I feel when he loses it. Once he loses it, I reattack him. I'm showing you the whole thing right now, and then I'm, we're going to break it down. When I reattack him, I go double over, but you've got to go elbows in to trap his head in. Or you can go to his chin and triceps. Go to chin, switch his head this way, weaken the body, I'm going the other way. Okay? So you pick the side you want to go to. I like to go with the chin. I can twist his head. When I twist his head, I'm going to put my elbow on the back of his neck, here like this. And I'm going to grab his thigh here. And I'm going to keep my hips in tight. And I'm going to walk around to the side. Okay? This is what you're going to do. He takes a shot. I find his head. I give him half my body. Push him away. Trap his head here. I want his head trapped in. Keep pushing it to me. Here. Okay, good. Now I'm off his power. At this point, I'm going to tap him. I'm not going to bring my blood and run around like most of our do. I'm going to stay on the hook in here, hook in his chin, hook him here, whatever. Okay? For whatever I decide to do, I'm going to keep my hips in on the tight. I'm going to reach around and grab his side. This is weak. You can still do this. But this is powerful. Because I got his side. He needs to crawl into me, push me, but I have a side. So I hook him. I can hook him here. Uh, all the way. Fighting, I'm going to the ground and ground, I'm going to hit. I'm going to hit. 